Hi Daimi, welcome back to my channel. I am Princess Sahira. Have you ever thought of marrying a foreigner? I mean, maybe from America, Australia, or maybe Korea. I bet a lot of you guys want to marry someone from Korea now. So, today we are going to talk about the foreign spouse indicators in your birth chart. The first indicators you can see from Rahu or North Node. Why Rahu? Because Rahu represents foreign um, places, foreign countries, foreign cultures. So if you have Rahu in the 7th house or Rahu in the 8th house or Rahu conjunct Venus, that is the first indication that you're gonna marry someone from a foreign country or simply a foreigner. The second indication is that if you have Venus in the 9th house, 12th house or the 3rd house, you might get married with a foreigner. Because the 9th house is the house of far distant travel and it is ruled by Jupiter. And the 12th house is the house of you know foreign places. And the 3rd house is the house of short distant travel but still, um, some people have um, Venus in the third house and still get married to a foreigner. The third indication is that when you have Sagittarius or Pisces in the seventh house or maybe if you have Venus or Mars in the seventh house. Why Sagittarius and Pisces? Because Jupiter is the lord of Sagittarius and Pisces and Jupiter is... Jupiter deals with foreign, foreign country, foreign cultures. And the fourth indication, Jupiter in the 7th or 8th house. Why? Because Jupiter uh, deals with uh, foreign countries, like I said. And Jupiter also, um, you know, deals with travel. So when it is in the 7th house, which is the house of marriage, or in the 8th house, which is the house of spouse and in-laws, so it could indicate that you're going to marry a foreigner. Or if you have Venus or Mars aspecting the 7th or 8th house. Now the 5th indication, if your 7th house ruler is in the 9th or 12th house, or your 7th house ruler is in Sagittarius or Pisces sign, or your 7th house ruler conjunct with Jupiter or Rahu, why 9 and 12th house? Because 9th house represents the far distant travel and 12th house represents foreign countries. Sagittarius and Pisces, um, it, because the lord of Sagittarius and Pisces uh, is Jupiter. Last but not least, remember that I've made a video about future spouse prediction uh, based on your DK planet. You guys can go and check that out again. If your DK planet is Jupiter or Moon, then it indicates that you're gonna have a foreign spouse as well. So I hope you guys could learn something from this video and maybe for those who wants to marry a foreigner will have this placement in your birth chart. So I will see you guys on my next video. Ta-ta!